So you've got a lot of bleeding here, okay, mummy? So we're just going to massage your uterus a little bit. Postpartum hemorrhage can be a life or death emergency on a maternity ward. 94.52 for that blood pressure, heart rate 66. But nurses at BC Women's Hospital are confident they won't lose this patient. Sim Mom is a high-tech mannequin. We connect the blood pressure cuffs on them. We can check their pulse on their arms. We can check their oxygen levels with oxygen monitors. We can start IVs and poke them. Her purpose is to um, do training for emergencies that are come around with birth. We can do a breech delivery, you can do a hemorrhage at the time of delivery. She has a c-section abdomen so you can simulate her having a cesarean. No air entry. Sim baby allows doctors to practice resuscitation on an infant that's not breathing. A simulation technician watches how the team responds to the emergency. If we were not doing these simulations on a regular basis, it's sometimes easy to lose some of the skill sets involved there. But Sim Mom and Sim Baby are starting to break down. They are degrading with time because we're using them so often. BC Women's would like to buy the next generation of Sim mannequins, like this premature baby, that are wireless and don't have to be tethered to a computer. A new Sim Mom would cost $80,000. They're not cheap. But it's money well spent. These nurses have never failed a simulation. <laughs> She's pulled through every time. Every single time. We're pretty good. We're pretty good. Shannon Patterson, CTV News, Vancouver.